guys, welcome to my channel. Today I am going to be showing you what is inside the April Rocker Box. This is my second Rocker Box, in fact it's their second Rocker Box. This is a brand new beauty box, £13.95 including postage. These boxes are curated by beauty bloggers and beauty vloggers. So the April's Rocker Box has been curated by Gabriella from Pretty Ugly. She is a beauty blogger who I have just started following on the back of this. This is another good thing about these boxes that you'll discover in beauty bloggers and vloggers who you might not already have found out about or heard about. So that's something I'm actually really enjoying about the boxes and then as usual it has a little leaflet explaining what is inside so I have already had a little peek in this box and I saw this nail zinc nail varnish and so I put it on my nails because my nails needed doing that's the nail varnish we received in the rock box and that's how the color looks totally does not go with what I'm wearing by the way this is a nail ink gel effect polish with plumping effect what I will say is this definitely needs two coats. It was the kind of nail varnish you put it on one coat and it kind of left bits that had no nail varnish on. Does that make sense? Like little streaks with no nail varnish on. This is in the colour Porchester Square and I absolutely love it. It's kind of like a neutral, but like a grey neutral, I would kind of say. Um, now this next thing I'm super excited about. On Instagram, not long ago, I saw, and I can't remember who it was now, forgive me if you're watching, and I can't remember who it was, who I saw it on. Somebody had a foot mask on her feet. And I was like, oh my god, foot mask? I've never even heard of a foot mask. And now I have my very own. Hallelujah! This Cure Bazaar from Paris, the natural pedicure ritual. So it's got a foot care mask and utensils. <gasps> very exciting! It's got one pair of socks, one file, and one wooden cuticle pusher. So I am extremely excited to try this, and no doubt on my Instagram you will see a picture of my little feet wrapped in their foot masks as well. I'm very excited to try that, because I've never used a foot mask before. Have you guys used a foot mask before? Is this something that's already always kind of like been around, I've just not known about? Foot masks? Really? I didn't know there was a thing. I didn't even know it was a thing. I'm telling you. So the next thing we've got is always something that's nice to see. It's a Frizzies, uh, John Frieda Frizzies Original Six Effects Serum for those frizzy hair days. The good thing about this is it's so lightweight. It's almost like there's nothing inside there. I'm sure there is. There is something inside there, but it's so lightweight. It's so again a fantastic one to take on holiday. This weighs almost nothing. Um, especially if you're going somewhere a little bit hot, a little bit humid. Uh, John Frieda Frizzies is one of the sort of oldest frizz products. You know, it was the first frizz product I think I even became aware of really uh, back in, gosh, I'm going to say the mid 90s. I've been using this on and off since the mid 90s. It's a great product, very reliable, great results. Happy to see it in a beauty box. Next we have a Crabtree and Evelyn La Source Ultra Moisturising Hand Therapy. Crabtree and Evelyn is lovely. It feels like a very sort of rich and nourishing hand cream. It smells beautiful. Yeah, that is a lovely, lovely hand cream. So that'll be going into my handbag. Then last but by no means least is a Smith & Colt The Shining Lip Lacquer. The colour is The Lovers. Now, I'm not the biggest fan of lip glosses, I have to say. This colour doesn't really look like it's going to be my kind of thing. I love the packaging. Really pretty. Um, this kind of quite bright pink, though, I'm not quite sure that's going to be for me but I will definitely give it a go because you never know you should try these things try something new it was inspired by beauty junkies so it's a little wonder that this lip lacquer ticks all of our boxes a glass like shine makes your pout pop yep a heap of volume plumping action thanks to port old lacquer pelosa you got it oh, it's a plumper as well interesting Meanwhile, the warm coral pink shade is a great way to transition your look into spring. Well, that's kind of sold me on it, actually. It actually sounds really, really good. It's got a bit of a plumper in as well. So, and it is quite a nice shade for spring. Maybe it is a bit more corally, and I was doing a bit of a disservice when I just thought it was plain pink. So I'll give that a go anyway. So that was it, guys. That is what was in the April Rocker Box. Like I said, this is a brand new box to the market, beauty subscription box. I've loved the two boxes that I've had so far. Um, I will definitely be using 
everything that's in here, especially the foot mask. I'm so excited about trying that. So some great products. I think what I'd like to see for future boxes is more skincare and makeup. So this is like lip, feet, hair, nails, hands. I'd like to see something for here. You know, I want some makeup or some skincare, and I love getting skincare. I love trying new skincare. So that would be my recommendation for any future boxes. Rocker box, if you happen to be watching. Uh, I'm sure you're not. Um, but yes, so another good box. Really excited. I'm going to keep my subscription going and see what else they come up with. Um, who knows, maybe one day they're going to ask me to curate a box. A girl can dream, a girl can dream. So I hope you enjoyed watching that guys. Thanks very much for joining me. Please give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Please subscribe to my channel, tell all your lovely friends about it, and I'll see you next time. Bye.